everybody, and I mean everybody, wants a pool, but not everybody can afford uh, uh, a pool that's, you know, built for Julius Caesar. Um, how can we make pools look awesome without really breaking the bank? So how can you build a pool without breaking the bank? You know, people sometimes Google how much does a pool cost? 10000 20000 it, It's like one of the analogies I love to use is like, if you're in the water and you close your eyes and you're floating on a raft, it could be a $400,000 pool or a $89 pool from Target, right? It doesn't matter. So it really depends on the environment you're trying to create and how that all kind of ties in. You listen, there, I could talk, you know, there's vinyl, there's fiberglass, there's gunning, there's all different types of pools and all, but you want to design something that makes sense. Again, you don't want to price yourself out of the neighborhood because you got the biggest pool in the backyard, right? So pools you have to really think about. It's not just seeing a pool and then want to swim in it, you know. Since COVID, everybody's staying home more, and we've had a huge increase in swimming pools for sure. Right. So when people are even considering getting a pool done, they can, depending on like the other things that you, that you incorporate with your designs, with the landscaping design around the pool, sometimes you can get, you can, you can do a, a less expensive pool and, and invest maybe more into the ambiance around it. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes if, if we come up to the final budget and it, it, it's, you know, becoming cost prohibitive, I would rather than do a smaller pool or make it out of vinyl or something and create, you know, do the lighting, do the speakers, create the whole environment. Nobody's going to come to the backyard and say, wow, nice hole in the ground with water. It's a nice backyard. It's how the whole thing ties together. It's kind of like when you go buy, uh, when you go buy a suit, right? You want a nice shirt, a tie, everything. You don't want to just wear a nice tie and have a crappy suit. So it depends on how the whole backyard fits together. You creating an emotion always remember that i'm just trying to create an emotion i want to feel like i'm on vacation in my backyard period hey guys steve here if you like the videos please reach out to me my cell phone is 914-879-5602 email steve at stevegriggsdesign.com yes i still answer my own cell phone you know i've been doing this for 35 years i know what i'm doing and i tell you like it is and just reach out. There's still time to do spring projects, so feel free. Even if you just have a landscape question, really, just reach out and give me a buzz. Thanks, and have a great day.